Maple syrup producers call this liquid gold. I'm Brandon Rowe at Shaw's, which is north of Barrie, where maple syrup season has come early. It's been uh, an early start to the season. Really quite a lot of uh, sap has flown already. Still lots of snow in the bush, so we're hoping that uh, we're in for a real good season. Golden brown nectar is not only a sign that spring is on the way, but Mother Nature is cooperating with syrup producers. Around this time last year, Shaw's had their first boil, which is considered late. However, this year, they had their first boil in January. We hope to make 1,000 gallons of maple syrup, which means we brought in 40,000 gallons of the watery sap to make it. When it comes to maple syrup production, everything is done in-house. So it's an 80-acre parcel of land here, and the blue lines are our main lines that transport the sap into us. All 4,500 trees run into our building right here. Shaw's has become a staple in Simcoe County. My great-great-grandfather purchased the property from the Grand Trunk Railway in 1893. So a lot of history here. Lots of history. Lots of trees tapped. For more than 100 years, generations of people have been coming to this location to try their famous maple syrup. This has been producing maple syrup since 1904. I'm the fifth generation to make maple syrup here. Everything is authentic here. We're not doing, nothing is for show. Everything is, is for the real production of maple syrup. And when you're done learning about the process, they serve you fresh pancakes with maple syrup that comes from their trees. Shaw's is open until Easter Monday. They'll also be offering horse-drawn carriage rides every weekend until they close and every day during March break. North of Barrie, Brandon Rowe, City News.